are available to me. It is. Oops, it went too high. There it is. Okay. We're going to go to Kilrog. Sticking with Horde. Um... I'm going to make this character as though I'm keeping him, just so we're on the safe side, okay? Uh, horde. Oh, I can be a monk. <laughs> he's a monk, then. I'm afraid he's going to have to be a monk. I just, I can't help it. I cannot help it. Let's customize his ass. Alright. Uh, skin color. I like a more blue. That's good. Face. Now I have a very definitive face. Oh yeah. He looks pissed. Hairstyle. Oh, do I have to have hair on him? That's good. No, we should give him some hair. What do you think? That was my original gut ring hair. That's more hanging behind them, right? Yeah, that's okay. That ain't bad. Let's change the hair color, though. I like the purple. No, I like the purple. You're never going to see it because he's got a helmet on anyway. Features, okay, this is where we remove his jaw. Oh, he looks gross like that. See, what I usually do is I remove the jaw. No, I don't like that. That's interesting. I like the jaw. See, that's what I usually have but without the eye crap. I might do that with the jaw. That's what I usually have for Gut Render with his tongue hanging out like that. But this one looks really good. I think we're going to keep that one. Okay, let's see if I can name him Gut Run. That would be funny, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it be funny if I could make a new Gut Run? Oh, look at Lucky. I made a new Gut Run on Kill Rod. Gut Runs begins again. Alright. Into the world we go. Good for people and ships. Should I do the fly through the crypt? Yes. Though Lady Sylvanas and the Forsaken finally took vengeance upon their hated enemy, the Lich King. Their dark crusade in Northland would be costly. Betrayed by Grand Apothecary Petrus at the Battle of Ratgate, the Forsaken's mm. devious plague of death was unleashed mm. upon both the Alliance and the Horde mm. to calamitous effect. Unbeknownst to Sylvanas, Petrus and his demonic ally, Veramactus, had taken control of the Undercity. As a result, the Forsaken were wrongly blamed for the traitor's atrocities. Though the Undercity was eventually retaken, Sylvanas and her followers still bear the weight of future sin. Mistrusted by the other members of the Horde, the Forsaken must now prove their loyalty to the cause and redeem themselves from their supposed treachery. To this end, Sylvanas has posted her defenses within the Tyrus Small Glades and readied her undead forces for any contingency. Mm -hmm. As one of the Forsaken, you must use your cunning and viciousness to slay any who will pose a threat to survive. This is my original introduction to the game, right? except I started the crypt, not up here. Okay, let's set him up like every other character I have. Auto loot. That's a big start. Display. Yeah, everything's good there. Uh, action bars. Boom, bang, zip, zang. There we go. Much better. I think that's everything I need to worry about. I won't block guild invites yet. Floating combat text is fine. Um. Okay. Uh, what about the 
Oh, I already got the percentages set up properly down there. Okay, so all that's good. And, uh, let's do some smart stuff. Yes, we know. Um, someone's favorite mount. We go up here. And my pets. Yes, yes, yes. Get away from it. My revived battle pets can go here. And my hearthstone can go there. And my cannibal eyes can go up here where it's supposed to be. Jab, yes indeed. Stance the fierce tire, good. Okay. I'm setting up this character as though I'm going to play it. Because it turns out I was able to actually recreate that run. This is Gutren on Killrog server as an undead and not a warrior this time, though I'm a monk. What do you uh -huh. think? So I've been reborn, basically, and that's where I'm going to be yelling as soon as I get into the town. Um, okay, next up is heirloom equipment. Do I actually have heirlooms for myself? I do, look at that. Okay, yeah, you know why I have heirlooms? Because I'm smart! Okay, that's intellect. We don't want intellect. We want... Is that a... Yeah, that's the right one. Bing, we want one. Hey, don't do that crap. How am I stunned? How am I stunned? Oh, I guess I have to talk to this person before I can even... Oh, I have to talk to that person to get up. Okay, now I'm up. Give me my heirlooms. <laughs> I'll take that one. Uh, shoulders, 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 shoulders. That's agility. I'll take that one. That cloak looks agility-like. I'll take that one. My tunic looks agility-like. Yep. And my pants look agility-like. And that's critical strike and haste. And that's stamina. Critical strike and haste, please. Two of those. And I'm going to take a dread pirate ring. I think the inherited insignia of the horde would be nice, too. As well as the inherited marker. Here. There we go. Look at all the stuff I get to equip. Now, let's see how I look once I get it all on. Cannot dual wield. Might not be able to dual wield until level 10. Okay, so I'll leave that down there. But how do I look already? Yeah, yeah. You you look like that ring. down here. We'll slap that over here. Okay, so I'm well equipped to get where I have to go right now. All that crap can go. I've been reading what I have to do here. Oh, so you actually have to go into your grave. Yeah, when I first started the game, you ended up, the camera would go down here and turn the corner around and turn the corner around and this is where you started in your grave. It was very cool, actually. I liked it a lot. Now, nah, however, it's not like that anymore. Except 
that quest will let me have to go somewhere. After all, I am only here to go somewhere and do something. Actually, why don't I on my bike? I should be able to ride my bike, shouldn't I? The chauffeur, right? Good. And I need the sea turtle as well. There we go. I am dancing. <clears throat> Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I believe it's a good thing. Well, good for you then. I'm actually starting from the beginning. Congratulations. goes a little bit orangey brown. Never gets used anyway, but that's fine. I'll put trade to green, because trade's all about money. And I'll worry about gilding when I get a guild. I'll probably change the experience bars and crap as well. Deliberately leveling up by revealing stuff. Hmm. It's been a long time since I've been killed off. either of us. Yeah. I'm listening. Nice. Into the inner city I go. Didn't take long, eh? <laughs>
I like that car. It's kind of like a sea for me. There we go. That's the rest of the trade. Hey, now it's time to see something in trade. Oops. Knock stuff over as I pick up the little controller or the uh, keyboard. Anybody who knows me on this server or recognizes the name will know I'm back now. <laughs> That's all I needed to do. Might not seem like anything important, folks, but this is where I gained my notoriety as being a good player. Uh, I still haven't really gained that on my new server, but I played from classic all the way up to Lich King on this server. Now we'll take a look for these numbers on this server. Shall we? There's Wolf Claw. So we get what's the lowest price for 200 wool. Don't care about wind wool. Well, there's an awful lot more cloth available on this server than there was on the other. 20 for... It's going... Jeez. But if 200 goes for 200, at least the price is more reasonable. But the wool cloth here seems to be very much just wind wool. Hmm. There's a 20 for 25. 50 for 50 approximately. Looks like the price is 189 wool cloth for 100 and... Okay, there's 200 wool cloth for 198. See, the price here is 50%, actually less than 50% than it is on the server we're on. So financially, we'd be doing so much better here. How much is linen going for? 200 linen for only 60 gold. Holy crap. The prices here are right. The prices here are exactly what they should be. Isn't that sick? That the prices on our server are stupid high in comparison? Yes. I wonder if that means that the guilds are screwed on this server. Questing, dungeons, raids, TV, availability weekdays and weekends as Damagio, Browse Guilds. Hmm. Oops, that's, that's all I do there. I don't even think uh, Arkham Asylum exists anymore. Mm -hmm. I should do a look for them. Mm -hmm. uh, is that social? Who? Um. I think I have to do Slash to at the beginning of that thing. Zero people found. Yeah, so I'm under the impression that there is no longer an Arkham Asylum.
<laughs> Pretty funny shit if it is. Not that I'm all that concerned. Now what professions should I have? Should I do the herbs and uh, alchemy that I'm deliberately doing with tick face? Or should I do kind of what I did with uh, Timbuktu and make him skins and uh, herbs and just let him do gathering and sell everything out of his garrison? What do you think I should do? Or are you too busy? I have no idea what you should really do. I mean, the gathering is useless to make the coin. Or should I do engineering here because I won't have, well, no, I have access to, I won't have the cool shit that I have on the other server without having one here. Hmm, I really don't know what to do with this character. Hmm. Oh, that's the audience.
Mm. <sighs> well, no one's giving me the information I'm craving, so I'm just going to leave this server for today. Why? Back to Brill, since that's the only place I can really go. Oh, I could actually fly all the way up to Silver Moon City if I wanted. That's kind of cool.
Mm. Gotta remember the name of this place before I reveal it. <laughs> Nightmare Vale. I can kill a level 6. First, I can kill a level 6. These bitches. Damn, I knew what I forgot to do. Oh, yeah, I never get an answer for you. An answer from them either. Look at the death I'm dealing already. I said, I can kill level 7s. Yeah, that seems like a good one. I'm already halfway to level fucking three and I haven't done any yet. <laughs> I haven't even done the first quest yet. <laughs> well, sorry, I did the first quest, but I haven't even done the second quest yet. That's pretty funny, isn't it? The monk does such damage though, I mean I couldn't help but choose a monk again. And I thought I'd try killing some random shit that was way higher. Triple my level and I busted his ass. Can't help it. Well, I think I'm gonna stop streaming. So, so. You get back here, get uh, situated. I'm gonna kill the stream for the day. Oh, that's the thing I don't have set up here, is it? Uh, townsfolk. I need to have my repair set up. Do I need anything else? Mm, innkeeper, I like having it set up as well. There we go. Good. <coughs> Apprentice Armorer. Here, take some of this shit. I don't need this shit. Now I'll just wait till I get to level 100. Fuck it! Right, folks, so thank you for watching today's stream. I do appreciate any uh, support you've given me over the time I've been streaming today. I'll be back again tomorrow doing some random ass shit. Um, who knows, I might even start streaming COD tomorrow, you never know. But if I do stream COD, it'll more than likely be without me speaking. And I don't know if anybody's going to be monitoring chat other than the wife as long as she stays out of Warcraft herself because she'll lose herself on that. So, uh, have yourselves a good day. Take care of yourselves and uh, remember, may all your...